Hello everybody and welcome to another review. It's been a while since we've had a true movie review, so I'm excited to be back. Um, and, and, and today we're doing a review of, I don't know if you can see it behind me, Snowden. Now this movie is about Mark Snowden, who, or not Mark Snowden, Ed Snowden, who was the guy who worked for the NSA and basically uncovered a bunch of overreaching government when they were hacking and, and, and attained basically everybody's private information from across the board. Now I don't claim to be the most enlightened person, but I know the basics of the story. I know, obviously I followed the news story when it came out. I don't claim to know every detail, but I have to say this movie going into us, I was a mixed about it because I don't know if this guy I, this movie, I mean, if you can't tell, it's going to play it off as he's a hero. And I'm not saying he's not in some senses, but in other senses, he, he is. He was. He did take classified information and, and reveal it publicly when it wasn't supposed to be. So there's a lot of things that kind of conflict with me about it. And I definitely say that that was definitely what carried over me in the movie. Uh, Joseph Gordon Levitt's one of my favorite actors. I think he does a fantastic job just about everything he does, with except for that one, uh, what was it, The Wire one? That one was a little bit. Uh, Come on, man. But seriously, no, this one here, as I watched it, I, I was intrigued and yet still, I mean, I, I, I saw both sides. I mean, I can't say I may not, I wouldn't do something different, wouldn't do the same thing if I was in a situation. I mean, it was a vast overreach of government, but they were doing so much more. Uh, but in the same sense, I, I, I felt like, you know, his portrayal was a little bit rigid. Now, granted, I think that the guy who he's actually playing is somewhat of a rigid character. And I mean, that's absolutely there. But I just felt like he, it didn't come off as a natural form of rigidity. So I feel like he, you know, his voice was very much changing his voice. It was very obvious through the entire time. And then you have Shalina, uh, Shalina, Shalina, whatever her name is, Woodley, from Divergent and Insurgent and all those movies like that, you know, and she, uh, she's an awkward actress for me too. The two of them, Joseph Gordon-Levitt's a really good actor. I feel like this may not have been the right role for him. Um, and then you add in her, who's already kind of an awkward, awkward actress. And so their chemistry, as far as a couple, didn't work that well. The whole story felt very pushed, very rushed in a sense, and, but in the same sense, very boring. I mean, honestly, I found myself at several points just being bored with it. Um, I feel like they really scraped along to, to pull up this ideology. I, I did like that they didn't just blame one side of the government, like one party or, or one president versus another president. I mean, they both, they, he gave full, they gave full uh, disclosure that both were the problem. So I thought that was an interesting thing. I, I enjoyed that they didn't try to make this oh so political. But it was definitely an interesting film. I, I, I'm, I'm once again, I'm not saying he's not a hero because I mean, he did, he he uncovered a very big thing. But I think that's something that carried over in a huge way. It was just that like, I don't know, about this. I don't know if this is what I want to think about this guy, what they're trying to make me think, and I'm not sure what to think. Because I, like I said, I think if I was in the same situation, I don't know that I wouldn't do the same thing. But I wasn't there, and I don't know, and I, I just, I have a tough time. You know, it's like I'm trying to put it together. I'd say this movie was okay. It was a 5.8 out of 10 for me. You know, I think it was a decent time. It was an okay movie. Um, but just nothing I would want to see again. I think it was poorly paced, and I feel like there could have been better people who maybe would have played each of the roles that were in this better. Nicolas Cage, best performance I've seen him in a while. Let me tell you what. Nicolas Cage, you're spot on. I thought he did a good job. Kind of back to his old, I don't know. He did, he did a good job with it. But all in all, guys, I think the movie is just one I would pass on. I wouldn't even really bother to see it. I mean, if you really, really want to, go for it. But for me, just didn't do it. Did not do it at all. Let me know what you think. Have you seen it down below? Comment down below what you're thinking. What do you, do you think he's a hero? Do you think he's not? I mean, I'm, I'm interested to hear your ideas because like I said, I really don't know. I, I, I think he's a bit of both, you know? And so I, I can't say that either way and so was that where you feel what is it let me know in the comments down below if you guys want to see more please come back and subscribe to our channel to see more tomorrow we'll be up with a vlog uh, that's taking place most of today uh and so yeah catch you guys later god bless see you next time